Introducing the all new Corolla. Governor Eddie Calvo has issued a special address saying that he would be introducing two bills in the coming days that use $15 million in additional Section 30 funding. The first bill the governor intends to introduce will pay out the balance of pay adjustments owed to law enforcement officers, and the second bill will fund the Hay recommended general pay plan at 100%. There would be no need to introduce any legislation today if the governor had just signed Bill 309. Senator Ben Pangolin and I had received information that there was going to be some $22 million that was in excess Section 30 money that was coming. And uh, in Bill 309, we appropriated it. We appropriated it for the very purpose of paying pay for all the agencies, not just the executive. And Bill 309 would have given money for the balance of pay adjustments for all law enforcement officers. But Governor Eddie Calvo vetoed the measure, saying that it was appropriating phantom money, phantom money that apparently exists as it was booked as fiscal year 2013 revenues. Not only was that $22 million real money that GovGuam is receiving, but apparently this $15 million that the governor wants to appropriate is even more Section 30 money above the $22 million that Senator Pangolinan fought to appropriate. The governor, in his veto message, said that when they receive the $22 million, it would be used for something else. He, he announced that he's going to be paying tax refunds, so I would imagine he's using the $15 million to pay tax refunds, and there, there must be another 15 I don't know. Cruz says this is precisely why Bill 309 was introduced in the first place, in order to require that the governor let the legislature know exactly how much money GovGuam is receiving so that the legislature can do its job and appropriate the money. Which is the reason why we introduced Bill, Bill 309, which was a uh, Section 30 Transparency Act, to, to demand uh, that uh, we be kept in, informed and uh, that we be allowed to exercise our organic constitutional responsibility of being responsible for the purse strings and appropriating the money that uh, is received. In